uh, my name is Peter Merry. We're uh, I'm director of Wisdom University in Europe, and we're here in Avery, England, uh, as the first of three pilgrimages in Europe this summer. And in Avery, uh, which is the one of I think the largest stone circle on the planet, um, and energetically, geomantically, as they say, the study of Earth energies. It's the place which is the energetic umbilicus or belly button of the planet. And we're exploring the implications of that uh, with our teacher Richard Leverton, uh, who is giving us both an overview of uh, how if we look at mythological stories, we can interpret from those what the energetic function is of different places and how it all connects up on the one hand. And on the other hand, we're getting uh, an experiential uh, feeling for the place through clairvoyance exercises and being able to actually see energetically what's going on uh, at this uh, at this location um, <clears throat> and then uh, later on in the week uh, we're going to be working with Karen Alexander to explore the crop circles what's the nature the geometry the dynamics of these phenomena and uh, also going to walk into a few uh, that show up while we're here. We just had apparently a new one reported this morning, uh, so that'll be uh, fresh for us to explore uh, over the next few days. In its essence, what it seems that we're we're looking at is how do we uh, reintegrate um, the more subtle energies with the, the earth context? How do we help revitalize the physical material realm with the information and energy uh, of the subtle realms? Um, and, and in that sense, uh, create vital and alive environments once more. And uh, although on the one hand it sounds like we're doing it to something outside ourselves, we're learning both conceptually and experientially that the pattern that is in the earth is also the pattern that's in our bodies, is also the pattern that's in the cosmos. So as we walk in the sacred spaces in the, on the earth, we're walking in, the, in our bodies and we're walking with them in the cosmos. So we're beginning to both expand our minds and our understanding of that concept and, uh, and feel it ourselves uh, as, we, as, we, uh, as we explore it in the field. So, uh, so far so good. Uh, uh, lots of openings and insights and we got some sun today. So uh, we can't do better than that in uh, England at this time of year. Yeah.